I wanted to show a demonstration of how air collects, okay? Because we're given a lot of verbal diarrhea out there and pe people have a hard time picturing it and things like that. Now what's great is our dealers, go to a dealer that has one of these and they can show this to you and then you can ask more questions. Is this a video and you're locked into just hearing what I'm, I'm spewing? But take a look at this. When, it, when you have a fuel tank sitting still, Caterpillar says there's at least 10% air in fuel in a solution right here, okay? And in a test cell, this fuel tank is up on top of the building having a net positive suction feed, okay? And what happens is that you have the great scenario in that test cell, you only have about 10% air in that fuel. It goes down under pressure so the pump doesn't cavitate, no vaporization or anything like that. And the building's not sloshing. Then the hot return fuel is about going back to another tank and not agitating, not contaminating their supply tank because aeration is, going to, is a contamination. But then when you heat it up, when that fuel is under a vacuum or being expanded, you lose from that, okay? So what's awesome about this display and what we're doing is when you plug it in, you can actually see how it builds up in trained air. Now it does it excessively quick. Okay, to get to this point or anything like this, it takes about an hour and a half of sloshing going down the road. Now remember when you're doing a dyno, it only takes about three minutes for this, uh, shut this off and this all, almost all the air to rise out. So you're, when you're doing a dyno, that's your stationary horsepower. Okay, you, that's not working horsepower. Okay, so you lose going down the road. The other place that you lose um, going down uh, from the test cell is that now this tank is below. So a lot, of, a lot of you all, not everyone, you have a suction side problem where the engine pump has to, it has to do what the fast is doing. So you have cavitation and things like that. Now, some of you had the pump in the tank, so that really helped out there. You still have the agitation. That's where you get the majority of your air from. The other place um, that you lose uh, performance is on a suction side filter, okay? So, but here you can actually see how the air goes in with the fuel. You can hear it cavitating right here. You can see virtually pure fuel going to the engine. And you can see that air, you just saw that burp back. Watch this, look at that. What do you think your stock filter's doing when you're hitting bumps going down the road? Go to fastride.com, you can find a dealer near you.